A grim numbers by Ontario Provincial Police. 2023 seeing the most traffic-related deaths in a single year on OPP patrolled roads since the early 2000s. As CTV's Tyler Kelleher reports, police are doing what they can to keep the roads safe, but say the onus also falls on drivers. Shocking statistics coming from Ontario Provincial Police. 2023 marking the deadliest year on provincial roads in well over a decade. As uh, the years have gone by, you know, numbers have been increasing. According to OPP data, last year saw 411 fatal crashes on OPP patrolled roadways, which also include pedestrian deaths involving a motor vehicle. 52 more than the year before and the most reported since 2007. Absolute tragedies for all respects uh, in terms of uh, the lives that are lost. The fact that those numbers have crept up is a very concerning uh, factor for us. OPP's West Region, the most impacted with 106. 52 of those deaths happening in the GTA. OPP pointing the finger at the leading contributors, reckless driving, distracted driving, and alcohol. We are up about 30% right now in, in impaired driving crashes as well as impaired driving collisions and more specifically in the GTA. This month, OPP's Highway Safety Division announced mandatory alcohol testing at all traffic stops in the GTA no matter what you were pulled over for. A move to put drunk driving in the rear view. These numbers can come down dramatically and obviously we're doing what we can, but we can't do it alone. OPP cover more than 127,000 kilometers of provincial roadway. They say responsibility falls on drivers to stay safe. The uh, consequences for making a bad decision can be life altering and can be deadly. Tyler Kelleher, CTV News. And for a closer look at the breakdown and the numbers, you can scan the QR code at the bottom left of your screen there to download the CTV News app. You can also read more in our article on our website, ctvnewskitchener.ca.